My name is Tony Gimignani. I'm from Paisano's Pizzeria in Castro Valley, California, president of the World Pizza Champions. Tony, who are the World Pizza Champions? The World Pizza Champions are a group of independent operators from around the U.S. They're the best bakers and competitors in the U.S. and we represent uh, the U.S. in Italy at the World Championships and we actually sanction and organize the World Games in Las Vegas, Nevada. What are you guys all about? Uh, World Pizza Champions are a group of independent operators that came together to promote themselves and their skills uh, in the pizza industry. Being an independent, it's very difficult to compete against some of the corporate giants and the corporate companies. Um, we became affiliated and became much bigger than that, and we were able to get on shows such as The Tonight Show, The Food Network, Good Morning America, The Today Show, um, from the popularity and stature and that some of these small town guys are bigger than you know most of the places in the big cities like San Francisco or New York we're just as big as any of those. What is it like to not compete in a single acrobatic competition anymore? Oh, not competing in a single acrobatic, um, I don't know, I just, uh, you know, I've won for a number of different years. I wanted to be more recognized in baking. You know, I uh, came out with a book called Pizza and a lot of people know me for pizza throwing but they don't really know me for about pizza and that was something I really wanted to um, I guess make myself more well-rounded as a pizza uh, individual or pizza competitor so that's something I really wanted to focus on was baking and that's uh, this year will be the first time. How do you think you're going to do in the baking category this year? In the baking category this year I actually graduated from the uh, pizza school of Italy one of the oldest schools uh, it was something I wanted to go to before I entered the pizza competition. So I, I know going into it, it, I'll do the best that I could do. So at least I know that, you know, um, I really couldn't get any better. So um, I guess I'll just give it all I can, you know. Are you satisfied with your team's accomplishments? Um, you know, seeing this uh, team start in, uh, you know, 2000, uh, five um, and seeing it where it is now, you know, a little bit after 2006, um, we've gotten bigger, better, most more recognized than any other team in the world. Um, we have more world titles than anybody, and I think by having that uh, clout, uh, we're able to get um, so far ahead than any other team. Um, just from the events that we've done, from the Chicago Cubs to sanctioning the World Games, one of the biggest competitions in the industry. Uh, I think that we've um, we have a lot f uh, further to go, but um, no other team has uh, gained uh, more than any and than anyone than, than us. So it's been a it's been a great ride. So I'm looking forward to see what happens in the future. Can you tell us a little bit about how the team is funded? Yeah, actually, most of us as uh, independent operators um, get sponsored individually, or we get sponsored uh, by a team. That's something that uh, was started. Uh, when I was competing back in the 90s, uh, I kind of thought of it as a race car driver. Um, you know, I saw a lot of those guys have um, their logos and patches on their on their jerseys. I thought that um, some of these companies in the industry um, could sponsor us. So by doing that, we were able to get funded for a team. So individually, I'm sponsored by uh, Roma, um, sponsored by um, Cardino's, Swiss American Sausage Company, uh, Pepsi and Pendleton and then we have a group of team sponsors that sponsor the whole team. As independent operators some of us use different companies. Um, I go through through Roma, Mike might go through um, Sofo, Sean through RDP. A lot of us um, get sponsored but then there's team sponsors that we get uh, so like Hobart, everyone has a Hobart um, and all of us have always used Hobart through the years so Hobart for instance is a team sponsor. Um, Revenge and POS Systems is a team sponsor. Cholula um, Hot Sauce is a, is a sponsor of the team. Uh, we all try to incorporate the, their hot sauce in, in our menus to support the sponsors. We really, we really want to like back our sponsors. We really want to say we use their products. That's something that's really important to us, uh, especially as an independent, because um, we always look for you know the best companies or the best products to use on our pizza. Uh, Foremost Farms PC44. For instance, PZ44 is something that we use in our dough recipes, so whenever you compete in our games or our sanctioned events, you're always going to know that PZ44 uh, was used in that dough. Um, that's something that's really important to us um, as a team. 
um, some of the other guys that are getting sponsored, and it's tough, you know, to go to Italy. It, there's a lot of money in jerseys. There's a lot of money in travel. There's a lot of money in the hotel, and uh, you know, pretty much everything to make it a whole package. All these companies have supported us really well, and that's uh, that's a key role of, of um, helping us out and helping us get to Italy.